Hi, I'm Dr. Christine Hanlon from the University of Central Florida, here to talk to you about how to build a strong argument. This is especially important if you're developing a persuasive speech where people may reject your ideas and you want to think about how you're going to use that factual information, that opinionated information, um, different ways that you're going to use to sway your audience. So the basis that we're going to use today is Toulmin's model. Toulmin, T-O-U-L-M-I-N, Toulmin's model. Um, was developed by Stephen Toulmin in the 1970s, and he published it in 1978, the revised version anyways, in 1978, that we're going to talk about today. So according to Toulmin's model, is when, when you have a um, position, an opinion, that you want to, to um, deliver to your audience, the first thing you want to think about is you want to name that, and that is called a claim. So the claim is the position, the opinion that you have, the um, idea that you want your audience to accept. Um, so the claim is very important, but you have to think about how you're going to get your audience to agree with this and accept this claim. And so the first thing that you want to do is you want to make sure that you have strong grounds. And that is the word that he used for data, evidence, any kind of factual information that you're using to support that the claim is valid. Okay, um, so data, evidence, anything that you're using to support the claim. But the problem is that the claim can't just stand on the data and um, the evidence that you're providing us with. It also has to have another critical component. And this turns into kind of a balance beam type of a situation where the grounds are holding up what he called the warrant. And the warrant is the reasoning. So it's what connects the claim and the grounds. So when you're providing the data and you're providing this factual information that's going to show us that the claim is true and that we should accept it, you also have to provide us with the warrant. And the warrant is the reasoning. So it's connecting the grounds, the data, the, um, the evidence that you're providing to support the claim, using reasoning to support that it makes sense, but you have to balance that very carefully so you can hold your claim up. So as you're developing your claims for your presentations, as you're developing claims for personal arguments that you may have with people in your family or in the workplace, always think about having strong grounds, but also the part that most people miss is the strong warrant, the reasoning that connects your information, your data with your claim. And that way it will hold weight and it'll balance and people will be more likely to accept your ideas.